Well, we have this, this metaphor um, that I use quite frequently called the stairway to miracles. Now, it's a metaphor, of course, and, and some people are, even before they come to optimal EFT and the unseen therapist, are already on the stairway in their own way. You know, they've had some, um, uh, you know, therapy training maybe. They've had some uh, spiritual meditative training, this kind of thing. Uh, they are lined up with the idea that there's the higher power and we need to, we need to get beyond our separate body illusion into this higher state and the higher we can go the better so i create a stairway to miracles now as it turns out not everybody is ready to just get on the stairway and just rip right up the steps and go to the top you know and instantly and there we are in, in complete perfect enlightenment uh, you know a, a spiritual master in no time okay no that stairway is a learning process for people. Um, and, and most of us are starting at the very low steps or no steps at all. We get on the first step and then we get another step and another step. So there's lots of evidence pointing to the fact, um, very conclusively and persuasively if you're paying attention, to the fact that, that we really aren't these separate bodies that we seem to think we are. Okay. That is an illusion. It is like we're in a dream. So, um, so we, you, you take a newbie, and, and I would have them, you know, understand some of those concepts, and then we're just going to start using the unseen therapist on something very simple, something easy to understand, easy to use, etc. And that is a physical symptom of some kind. Almost everybody has a physical symptom of some kind, okay? Something doesn't work, something hurts, something whatever, okay? And so, uh, and even if you don't have one, um, you can certainly find some friend of yours who does, okay? Because <laughs> they're, they're all over the place, all right? So, assuming you have one yourself, we would just simply aim at that symptom. And let's just say that you've got arthritis in the hands and, you know, to do this hurts, okay? So we would aim the unseen therapist at just that symptom. Now, we understand that's not a cause. We're not aiming at the cause, but we are aiming at a symptom. And a beginner needs to get results right away. They're still on step one of the stairway to miracles. Okay? And so there they are with their pain, their arthritis, let's say. Maybe it's a vision issue. Uh, you know, uh, you know, maybe it's a sinus issue, I, whatever, or stomach, stomach distress or whatever, but I'm just taking one for the moment. So to do this, to do this is like, like say, well, that hurts to an eight. Okay. So we will bring an unseen therapist. We will aim at the symptom. We may have to do it a few times, twice, maybe three, four, five, something like that. Maybe, maybe just once. But after that, we'll, we'll test it again and we'll say, okay, now, well, that was an eight, but now that doesn't hurt at all. Oh, that's an eight. That's an eight. Okay, now we've got an, an improvement. Now we've got proof, evidence, because nothing really happened. There were no drugs. There was no pills. There was no massage. There was no heat. There was no anything other than unseen therapists coming in, and now it has improved. Okay, so they're on step one. Okay, now, um, behind the arthritis is likely uh, some emotional emotionally charged specific events in one's life that aren't resolved. Okay. That's how we get down to cause for this. But we at least got a symptomatic and noticeable and wow, symptomatic relief on step one. Okay. Then we're going to go up step two, some other physical examples, do it with other people maybe, etc. Still aiming at symptoms. Okay. Not the most efficient way, but still aiming there and getting results. So we're going, something is happening. I, all I'm doing is calling on the unseen therapist and something is happening. Maybe not every time yet, but I'm doing this enough time, something is happening. Something very real is happening. Okay. Uh, maybe I'll try to explain it away as many people do. <laughs> you know? they, they tend to say, oh, well, all my therapy finally worked, or the pills I took three weeks ago are finally setting in, or uh, I mean, you, you, you get some answers like this once in a while. But you keep doing it, and you cannot ignore the fact that unseen therapist is doing something 
important, and you are now on the beginning steps of this stairway to miracles. Above that, we start to get into specific events and causes and things like that, and we get into more and more advanced things as we climb and climb and climb and climb up the uh, stairway to miracles. Now, somebody can go as far as they want. Um, they can just get on step two and just have something that, that helps with some symptoms, uh, step one, I mean, and helps with symptoms once in a while, fine. Uh, they can go further if they want and help with the causes of some ailments that they have, fine, they get better results still. Uh, or they can get very enthusiastic about all of this and really start climbing and be a real student and spend lots of time communicating with the unseen therapist, having their life unfold in, in many magical ways that weren't there before, or not, as the, as, the, as the particular person chooses. And if you go to step 18, and that's far enough for you, for now, a few years later, ah, let me resume. I'll go from step 18 to step 41, or whatever it may be, and on up you go. So it's always done at your own level, at your own um, pace, uh, wherever it fits, fits for you. So the stairway is a very flexible stairway. Go as high as you want.